Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Pokemon. <laughs> this has been in the works for a long time, and the one thing I knew I wanted to do other than the countdowns was that I wanted to do a Let's Play. And after going through all of the... thinking about which generation I could record, uh, first generation red and blue didn't want to do, uh, gold and silver, um, my... all my batteries for... sorry, the... Uh, what's it called again? Um, all the batteries in my, um, cartridges for gold and silver and crystal have died, so I legitimately cannot play them, because I can't save the game, and there's no way I'm beating gold and silver in one sesh. Um, Ruby and Sapphire, Fire Red Leaf Green decided not to do those ones, and from Gen 4 onwards, unless I use a ROM, I have no feasible way of actually recording it. So, I guess that left me with Colosseum and XD, and out of the two, I just decided to go with which one I think is my favorite, and I think I prefer Col uh, <laughs> I think I prefer XD over Colosseum, so uh, I kind of left this for a bit too long, and now the <laughs> trailer's playing, so yeah, um, I'm, they, people aptly questioned how the hell I'm going to do this in Pokemon, because this is a really long game, as I've probably stated before, you guys probably know, so... What I'm going to do is I'm doing utterly super episodes. Ugh. I'm doing utter, utterly super episodes. I'm going to have... I have it charted out how far in the game I want to get by each episode, and from there, I will go and play through this entire game at least as best as I can in the space, in the space of this month. So, I really hope you guys are excited for this, because I am certainly excited. So, uh... I don't know <laughs> whether I should wait for this day, and I think it's just about over, and... Oh, I feel like I must point out, um... I am, like, all set to record, because I am sitting here, um, with a footrest, um, a big pillow for my back, a neck pillow, and as well a blanket to cover myself with. So, uh, here's an image that I put up on my Twitter. So, uh, yeah, I am all set to play this game. So, uh, I really forgot how long this cutscene is. So, uh, how about we just... Yep, okay, we're back at the title screen, and... Yeah. Pokemon XD, Gale of Darkness. Okay, because I deleted my old save file, which was pretty much 100%. So, how about we go new game? Oh, yes, start a new story. And my name... <laughs> oh, this is one thing I always loved. My, my actual name is one of the defaults. <laughs> oh, and Adam! Oh, Adam, what are you doing here? <laughs> uh, yep, new name. Uh, let, let's just go with the classic. Yeah, because for this, all you guys know me this speedster, so, yep, let's get started. Oh, all right, we're starting off the game right with a battle. <laughs> so it's Salamis versus Metagross. This is an interesting pair of let me see it. Oh, look at this moveset. This is fantastic, but gotta go with the super effective moves. It's always what you gotta do, and <laughs> oh, turn this Metagross. Although I would have preferred to be controlling the Metagross in this situation, but I honestly can't complain. Ah. Oh, now, now that I'm really here, I'm, I am honestly hoping you guys can't hear my hear my Wii because it whirs like a bitch. It's like, it's really loud whenever a disc is in it. It's just, wow. And, oh, 
Damn, I, I, have to, I have to take the blanket off. I just I just have to take the blanket off. It, 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 why is it so hard in this room? Okay, Sentrainer lost in. And yep. First battle won by a landslide. Woo! <laughs> Alright, Speed. That will do for today. This will do for today, sorry. Yes, sir. That was a well played battle. Speed, your battle skills have improved by an amazing amount. I mean, it was impressive the way you handled that big Pokemon with Aplomp. Aplomp? You took command of it as if it were the same as your Eevee. Don't you think it's time that you consider raising other Pokemon besides your Eevee? Okay, now we're actually in control of our character. So, this is interesting. And, one of the most interesting things, your starter Pokemon's an Eevee. You could not ask for a better starter Pokemon. And, this starting moveset, amazing. Especially this, this move. You get Bite from the start. I am... Um, You'll be excited the second you figure that out. Okay, and here, you got a blackboard, or whiteboard, whatever you want to call it. This tells you absolutely everything you need to know about the game. So, I already know all this. <laughs> um, excuse me, I've been playing Pokemon since I was four. I think I understand this. <laughs> Let's go in here. Hi, Speed. Have you finished training? Speed, this is the director's office. Did you want to pay a visit to, Dr. to Professor Crane? <laughs> you don't need to be that stiffly official, Lily. But... Oh yes, I've heard the battle coach singing high praise about you, Speed. I've heard that your battling skills have improved dramatically recently. That's outstanding, Speed. I sure don't think I'd stand much of a chance against you. <laughs> I, wish everyone, I wish everyone wouldn't drown them with such gushing praise all the time. My son and daughter will become spoiled rotten. There's nothing to worry about. Both Speed and Jovi are wonderful kids. By the way, I don't think I've seen Jovi since lunchtime. Speed, I hate to bother you, but could you go find Jovi for me? Speed, I think you already know, but several research projects are in their critical phases in their lab. This lab. That's why your mother can't afford to take any moment off right this moment. So please, t please, honey, will you go find Jovi for me? Okay, I need to learn how to speak better. Uh, yes. Thank you, I'm counting on you. I don't think she could have wandered off too far, but just in case, check outside too. I'm sorry, Speed. After five long years, this project is finally on the verge of coming true. But for that to happen, we can't do without your mother's expertise. Oh yes, I left a PDA in your room, Speed. Go check it out. PDA stands for Pokemon Digital Assistant. It's a very useful electronic tool. A PDA can be used for email, among other things. Oh my god, it's like the beginning of smartphones. It's like PDAs. I don't know. I'm, I'm too young to remember PDAs. I'm sure that you'll find its many u features useful. It's quite easy to use, Speed. I'm sure you'll have no trouble figuring it out. Okay, and we're off. And, <laughs> oh, I'll, I, I'm just remembering something about this game. One of the most interesting things about this game is that you can literally play this game one-handed. Because, um, uh, what am I saying? Um, you can, because I'm doing this with a GameCube controller, you can control this with a, with the proper, uh, uh analog stick, the D-pad, and the C-stick. So really, you can do this game one-handed. Oh, what's in here? This is our sister's room, Jovi. Blah, blah. Okay, I don't know why there's two beds in here. Oh, we gotta, whatever. Alright, what's in here? Yep, it's Speed's room, but literally his, his sister appears to have the run of the place. <laughs> oh, Jovi. Hey, there's something on the desk. If only I knew what it was like to have a sister. All I got was a brother, and I'm the younger one. Oh, I got an email. If you're reading this email, then you must have attained the PDA. Try it out, it's amazing. It's many features. By the way, Adam was playing hide and seek with Jovi. Why not have a chat with him? Okay, gotta find this guy named Anon. Oh. Ooh, three potions! Great from the start! Whoop, whoop, whoop! Got that potions. Now we gotta go find this Anon, and trust me, if there's any person I see named Anon, I am immediately suspicious about having a... Um, my... If I had a younger sister, I'd be concerned about having them with... Hmm? Ah! Who's this guy? Maybe I'll just go and shuffle on out of here. Oh, yes, I remember it. <laughs> Your character is the best strut. Oh yeah. Yo. Where my crew at? Yeah. Alright. <laughs> oh, you started me. Oh, hi. It's you, Speed. It's me, Adon. You're looking for Jovi? There's people playing hide and seek right now, but isn't she around anywhere? Well, she's go maybe she's going off to C Dr. Kamiko's manor. Whoa. It's a big weird house southeast of here. Ah, alright. Jovi. Jovi's it in our game behind seek. I wish you'd go back to me. My back is starting to hurt. Wow. My sister's a jerk at this rate. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to go. Oh! oh. 
Hi, Speed. The lounge is busy, so I'm going to see what the commotion is all about. The TV news just came out, so maybe something big happened. Let's go see, Speed. Uh, but I'm on a quest! I'm on a quest! I shall go and retrieve my sister. Huh. This news. We bring you OMBS news. Authorities still have failed to find any traces of the cargo ship SS Libra since its sudden disappearance off the coast of Gassion Port. There have been no reports of flotsam that may indicate the ship's sinking. The authorities appear mystified by the way the ship vanished like smoke. The reports that numerous folk were on board consider this rising over their welfare. Whoa, a cargo ship carrying Pokemon disappeared without a trace. Is that really possible? I'm finding it a little hard to swallow. Ah, hey, it's Psyduck. Psyduck! Someone on the TV set appears to be disturbing the Pokemon. Yes, you got a headache, buddy. Oh, yeah, alright. Quag! Quag! Quagmire! Boo! Down the stairs we go. And it's time to explore this world. But first, perhaps there are some things that we can go and find, because I remember right over here, there's a little thing that's tucked away. It's a Pokebox. Two antidotes! I could not be happier. This is a good start to the game. I'm just getting got three potions, then two antidotes. And uh, there might be something over here, if I remember correct. No, there is not. Well, I don't just look like an idiot. Okay, I'm... Ugh. <laughs> Alright, gonna head off to the overworld. Okay. Ah. It's really weird because I'm like recording this a month before Pokemon starts, and at this point I legitimately just finished my first week of university, and uh, let's just say it's different to high school. It's um, uh, weird thing is when you do an arts course, you got to do a lot of weird stuff. But first of all, ooh, this is a spooky mansion. Oh, it looks like some Scooby Doo's gonna happen. Let's go in. Wait, oh, goes that? You must be the guy uh, Chobun will put you straight up, don't you move. Chobun is the name, and Chobun is the number one assistant to Dr. Chemical. Chobun is the only assistant to Chobun has to be the number one assistant. <laughs> I don't know what boys I chose, but yeah, okay, this is our first proper battle. We had that battle against the Metagross, but that didn't count. Doesn't count. Oh, good, our first battle is against the weakest Pokemon. Let's go, Eevee! Yeah! Just look at that. Oh, I'm already level 10 and got a ton of experience. That's good. Okay, and I'm doing something twice. I'm twice this thing's level. Ugh, shit. Sorry, I'll edit that out. I'll, f I'll, I'll fix it in post. Ah, uh, alright. And I must say that while the battle animations are good, like this was the first 3D, actual 3D Pokemon adventure, only problem is that it's kinda slow. Both Coliseum and XD are pretty slow games. Um, XD is quite a bit faster, but, uh, that doesn't mean, that doesn't stop it from being slow. So, ooh, we beat Chobin! Yes! Chobin, uh, Chobin lost. <laughs> you lost your glasses. Ah. You've made Chobin aggro now. You don't have to make a loss. You're still not going to have Chobin. Uh, close up the observation with the subject of the child. Ergo, the subject is not a burglar. What do you know? Kids can be thieves. We can break into places. What are you? You're younger than me from the looks of it. <laughs> Shovel wishes you spoke up right away. Your speed? Shovel apologizes for dropping to the wrong conclusions. Hey, it's my sister. Oh, Big Brother. What, what are you doing here? Oh, did we get it? Big Brother, you got lost, didn't you? No. Ah, uh, ah, uh, you know how you said for Joey. Because Joey knows. This house is this big house of Dr. Kaminko's. Dr. Kaminko's job is to make incredible inventions. There's a whole bunch of neat machines like they have in the Pokemon HQ lab. You should come and do, Big Brother. Ugh, Jovi. <clears throat> so, you know that girl's other brother? Sometimes she comes around. She's, she wanders around there everywhere. She's trouble for the heart of keeping an eye on her so she does not bother the doctor. Oh, yes, Speed. You will have a look at Dr. Kaminko's inventions, you will, yes? Okay, this way, please. Follow children. Alright. Yes, we're heading in then! Alright. Okay, so we will now show you the versions of the inestimable Dr. Kamiko. Dr. Kamiko's versions, in it's to be said, are number one in the world. Chubbin is full of admiration. Oh, why does Chubbin know that they are number one worldwide? Then it's swinging? In the whole wide world, no one but Dr. Kamiko will invent such a vengeance. Therefore, they are number one in the world, with that question. 
I thought Kamiko, who was very really great, is inventing in that room with it. Hi, Doctor. What kind of funny machine are you making this time? Sylvie wants to know. Uh oh, the girl is that Kamiko side again. Sylvie hopes she is causing those students. Ah, uh, anyway, Cho let Chobin acquaint you with just some of Dr. Kamiko's great inventions. Let the VCR roll! VCR?! <laughs> oh, man, I feel old. Dr. Kamiko's inventions are number one in the world. Chobin's choice is this, that are the unhealthy sandals. The unsold stuff with lumpy nubs that fail to simulate every pressure point in a fabulous way. Keep wearing these, and Chobin will guarantee painful feet and chronic worsening of your health. Gr Chobin thinks it's super loose. <laughs> ah, a cripple is not, there's much more than this. The doctor's vicious, which are fantastic. Rabbitson on this matter. So I don't give this permission to use it to take me luck. I don't know what voices I'm doing, but let's go! Jovi! Jovi, you come with me right now! Hi, big brother. This is Dive Pai Jong. If all the details are, I'm really well to see. Huh? Are you gonna have a right, baby? We just got here. Oh, don't forget that. Jovi has to show you how to get home, right? Okay, that's what we'll do. Jovi will take you home. Nimi, let's go home with Big Brother. That is not the sound it made. That is not the sound it made. It was like, Eeeh! Jovi, join the party. C can I send her out in battle? I'm gonna get beat up? That'd be amazing. <laughs> okay, I'll just move out. Jovi, we'll do it again, Doctor. Bye bye. Okay, let's head back. I'm very sorry about the idea of. <laughs> I don't have a sister, so I don't know. Oh, email. Zemails. J Speed, you appear to have traveled far in your search for Jobin. Please come back to the HU lab as soon as you find her. I need your help with something. Ooh, we need help with something, but. Other, other, English on the feather? Who wants you to come home quickly? Jovi's well, but then you go by yourself, brother. Jovi will go home too. Let's go right now. Ugh. I don't know what it's like to have a little sister, but if I had a little, little, little sister like this, I would definitely let her be sent out into battle and get beat up by animals. Ugh. Let's go home on my scooter! Yeah! Badass vehicles. Ah, yes. Oh, it's mom. Let's have a conversation. Oh, hi, mommy. Hi, mommy. We're back. Oh, Jovi. Haven't I told you not to wander away by yourself? No, mommy. You don't understand. Big brother was off, so Jovi brought him here. If Jovi went there, Jovi bet he'd be crying by now, saying he couldn't get home. What are you even talking about? I slap you silly. Right, big brother? Oh my my my, Jovi, you're such a brave and resourceful girl. But that's quite enough for today. Besides, a doll must be tired of waiting for you. Oh my gosh, I was in the middle of hiding the thing. Okay, big brother, I'll see you later. Bye bye. Ugh, what a miserable girl. Speed, thanks for running Jovi for me. Oh yes, Professor Cream wanted to see you, Speed. Go see him right away, please. Alright, let's go and meet this esteemed Professor Crane. Is it in here? Where is it? <laughs> I see, I haven't seen you in a while. You're doing well? I don't have to worry on that. It's really okay. Cool. What about my scene? I need to focus on what done. So, it's done. Just get. Hey. Oh, Sublissy is over there. But whatever. Let's go see what the professor wants. Well, he was in here. Let's see if we go back. Hey, you gonna try? I guess he just went out there a little bit. You didn't bother to him? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get. I remember. <laughs> you gotta go up, find he's not here, and now he's here. I can see you right there. Did you teleport? Are you a wizard? Can you apparate? You can apparate, guys. Apparating is real thing. Ah, uh, uh, <laughs> whatever. Let's just go talk to him. Ah, hi there, Speed. Have been waiting for you. No, you haven't. You just got here. I wanted to show you the snag machine. Has a done? Has, has a ding? I didn't. <laughs> I don't know what I'm trying to tell you about the snag machine. No. The snag machine is a special device for snagging Pokemon. Two of us, Adin and I, were developing it, and now it's finally finished. Let's begin testing ability. Speed, will you help us? Yes! The machine allows me to steal things! Okay, step inside, please. Let's go. I should tell you, the snag machine is an outrageous piece of work. After all, it's used for stealing Pokemon from another trainer in battle. But we didn't make this to steal Pokemon indiscriminately from trainers. Sweet, you've heard of Shadow Pokemon, haven't you? They're Pokemon that have been turned into fighting machines after having their hearts closed by artificial means. They're to be pitied. We developed the sand machine to take back such modified Pokemon. Pokemon. Why this machine is needed now, I can explain later. But for now, I'll let you to test our sand machine. After all, you're the best trainer at this lab. 
The same machine is inside the inside this case. Try equipping it right away, please. Yes. I am ten years old, and I am the best trainer here. I find that hard to believe, but whatever. I don't care because we get a swag ass cutscene. Look at that. My arm is made of metal now. Not really. It's just a shoulder pad and a glove with a wire. Wow, it fits you perfectly. It looks cool too, Speed. I'll add a new feature to your PDA. It's called the Shadow Monitor. It lets you check in on the Shadow Pokemon you've encountered. Yeah, I got the Shadow Monitor! Yes! It's like a chip. Straight to memo. And there. Oh, I'm starting with a $5,000. This is brilliant. Thank you, Aden. That's a speed that's spot on. From here on, it will be a lot easier to show you how it works in practice rather than trying to describe it. Let's go search the battle system, system room. Oops, that's helping me. I forgot to give you these. In order to use a sand machine, you need at least one Pokeball. So I'll give you these. Five Pokeballs! Woo! Pokeballs aren't used in the Ori region, so we import them from other region. From another region. Okay, now we're set. Let's hurry over to the director. Aye! Aye! Huh? What's that? What's going on? Who are you people? Okay, I'm in control. <laughs> I didn't realize I was in control. At terrible speed, some strange man came barging in and took off with the director. <gasps> it's time for a rescue mission. The ten-year-old's gonna save the day. That's what always happens in these action movies. Or games. Oh no, he's unconscious. Not the Pinaco! No! Oh no, it's some thugs. It's bad. Will you let go of me? Where do you think you're taking me? <laughs> I'm taking you to your new lab, Professor. What? My new lab? Move it. We don't have any time. If you don't want to get hurt, hustle yourself into the car. You people, what are you? I got it's time for the ten-year-old to save the day! Huh? What is it, punk? You're gonna play hero and try to stop us? I don't show mercy to anyone. Not even kids! Oh, spy naps! Ah, uh, come on, it's our first real business battle on- Huh? Oh, <laughs> well that's an awkward camera zoom. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's a Teddy Ursa! It's adorable. let's go Eevee! Let's battle! Even though I didn't heal after the last battle. Huh? Oh, the Scouter Vegeta! Where's the Vegeta Meenum? What, what is that? Speed, the Aura Readers are spawning, that's a Shadow Pokemon! Hurry, Speed, hurry, throw a Pokeball at it! Let's fight! Speed, that's not it, hurry up and throw a Pokeball! Do you not understand how battle it works? I gotta weaken this thing first. Ah, whatever, fine. Pokeball, let's go. Even though in most circumstances this would not work, because Teddy Ursa has a kind of a higher catch rate. So, let's catch this Pokemon. You're gonna see this Night Machine in action. This is the main mechanic of this game. Get a Pokemon Thief! What was that accent? Yeah, you're like Team Rocket. Woo! Got Teddy Ursa, even though that's probably not how this would go down in any other game. Alright. That's going as a, what was that? My shadow Pokemon. Was that? Was it a snag? Woo! I got $165. Teddy Ursa joined the party. Woohoo! Everything's all good for me. Yeah. Kid, what's that machine on your arm? Could it be a snag machine? What the heck is that doing here? That's big news. Come on, move. I need to report this to headquarters like now. Uh, why didn't the muscle man fight me? Oh. <laughs> Oh yes, you didn't get to see him throw the animation. Save me time on animation. Oh no, this is bad. Why did I just stop? <sighs> I don't know why I just stopped. I could have possibly saved him. <sighs> Sad times, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, to take the professor away. Don't cry, Jovi. I'm sure Professor Crane will be okay. <laughs> we contacted the police and the proper authorities about Professor Crane. They should let us know if they discover anything. I still can't believe that this is happening. Professor Crane predicted that someone will again try making Shadow Pokemon. His prediction was on the mark. Speed, the Teddy Ursa you sang probably isn't the only Shadow Pokemon that was made. When the Purified Chamber is completed, we'll be able to save many Shadow Pokemon at the same time, but... Professor Crane is crucial to this project. Without him, there's nothing we can do! Moment. Dramatic pause. Let's complete it. We'll finish the purified chamber ourselves. Lily, the director's not here. It's hopeless. There isn't any possible way to get it done. 
You're on the verge of finishing. This is the time to feel sorry for yourself. The Purified Chamber Project got this far not just because of Professor Crane here is here. We got here because we all worked as a team. Have we come this far? It'd be wrong to stop now. Our product science is on the line. Let's finish the project as one! Things will get very busy around here. I'll go upstairs and check how the data process is progressing. Yeah. That's it. Music! We got this. We're feeling spry. Let's go and do this. And I feel this is a good time to end the episode. This has been a long episode, so next time on Speed... <laughs> next time on Speedster Plays, let... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I haven't done an outro in a bit. Ah. Next time on Speedster Plays Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness, we are going to go and try and find Professor Crane. See you guys all next time.